आज ही डाउटनेट ऐप डाउनलोड करें डाउटनेट पर होगा अब आपके सभी मैथ्स केमिस्ट्री फिजिक्स और बायोलॉजी डाउट का सफाया बस अपने क्वेश्चन की फोटो खींचो उसे क्रॉप करो और तुरंत वीडियो सोल्यूशन पाओ डाउनलोड नाउ so this question says that let a and b be the two real numbers such that a is greater than 1 b is greater than 1 and other statement is if a is equals to a 0 0 b then limit n tends to infinity of a a raised to power minus n is dash uh, which like which matrix right first option is given as unit matrix second is null matrix third is 2i and fourth is none of these so let us solve this question so first of all we need to find out the value for a raised to power minus n so first of all we will find out the value for a square then a cube and by using uh, the general formula we will be uh, getting the Value for a raised to power minus n. All right. A raised first we'll getting uh, we'll be getting a raised to power n, and then we'll be getting a raised to power minus n. So let us start. So what is the value for a? A zero, zero b. So uh, let us uh, calculate the value for a square. So a square will be a zero, zero b. Multiply by a zero zero b right so after multiplying these two we'll be getting a square zero zero b square we'll be getting this now let us calculate the third thing a cube for the general formula we need to uh, have at least a square and a cube for uh, deriving the general formula for a n right so here it will be a square 0 0 b square and multiplying it with by a 0 0 b and we'll be getting a cube 0 0 b cube right so this is the value for a a3 a cube you can say so now let us uh, calculate the value for an so what will be an by using these two so we are getting like uh, if we have a raised to power 2 then we are we are getting a square 0 0 b square if we have a cube then we are uh, getting the answer as a cube 0 0 b cube so these things these powers are equal to this this power so we can write it as a raised to power n 0 0 b raised to power n this is a general form for this matrix right but we need to what we need to calculate is we need to calculate is a raised to power minus n here right so For a raised to power minus n, we'll be taking the inverse of this matrix. So a raised to power inverse of this matrix will be determinant of this matrix. What will be the determinant of this matrix? This multiply this plus this multiply this minus this multiply by this. So this multiply by that means a n multiply by b n minus zero will be uh, we will be getting this, right? So after this. uh here adjoint matrix so adjoint matrix will be this transpose right so this is the inverse of this an so further we can solve it when we take it inside the matrix so we'll be getting first as 1 upon bn sorry 1 upon an it will come 1 upon an a raised to power n here it will come zero only here it will come zero only and here it will be 1 upon b raised to power n so this is our inverse matrix now uh, the question says that limit n tends to infinity 
for a raised to power minus n limit n tends to infinity so if here we apply the limit thing so if limit n tends to infinity is equals to so uh, you can see that if a n is tending to infinity right if a n is tending to infinity here then this whole value will be tending to zero similarly if this uh, n tending to infinity then that means b b n will be tending to infinity only so 1 upon b n will be tending to zero right so this matrix after applying the limits it will become 0 0 0 0 so what is this matrix this is this is a null matrix what we call this matrix this is a null matrix and our answer will be null matrix let us uh, check which option is matching with our option with our answer option b is the correct answer we will be getting null matrix this is the correct answer क्लास सिक्स टू ट्वेल्थ से लेके नीट आई आई टी जेई मीन और एडवांस के लेवल तक 10 मिलियन से ज्यादा स्टूडेंट्स का भरोसा आज ही डाउनलोड करें डाउट नेट आप या व्हाट्सएप कीजिए अपने डाउट्स आठ चार सौ चार सौ चार सौ पर